Ew. What the fuck? This is actually concerning who takes this much shit. This isn't normal. The ironic thing is that he would really only need maybe three more supplements if he went vegan lol. This def contributed to his problems. Also night night. Alright, well nighty night Kenny. Thanks for the donation I was dude. trolling bro. I'm not that bad lol. But it would be over for that guy. If you are short, ugly, balding, poor, or you have mental issues you are an incel. Best advice for that guy would be to rope and rear roll for better genetics. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, I don't think being like poor, balding or anything means you're automatically an incel, but uh, yeah, I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't rope and re-roll. <laughs> Thanks for the nation though, vegan incel. Yeah, so, uh, seems like your kid's picking up your shitty fucking habits, dude. Yeah, maybe you'll die the same way, a fucking heart attack or something. Um... What else? Is it gonna load anymore? I don't know. Whatever. Stupid kid. See more yo-yo videos. Oh, Jesus. Is this like what, like, you're proud of your son for this? <laughs> it just goes on. Like, he must have been actually proud of his son for being able to do this. Holy crap. Your kid's a loser. Uh, recovery. And then, and then, um, intra, you know, I take a product called recovery. Um, which is basically a combination of essential aminos and cluster dextrin. Okay, recovery supplement. We'll add that. Holy shit. So this is what I take during my workout to help me recover. I also have a product called Recovery, which is these two combined, plus a little extra ashwagandha extract uh, called Sensoril, which is an awesome supplement. But today I just wanted to show you the, um, the bags. The recovery is not in the new bags yet. It'll be two or three weeks. So the essential amino acids, these are loaded. It's 10 grams of essential aminos, seven of which are BCAAs. So <laughs> I think that's probably the, um, the most per serve. Uh, it, like it, it's, it just blows my mind that this guy did a fucking interview talking about how vegans can't get enough amino acids. And then he has a fucking amino. Yeah, recovery supplement, amino acids. He has a fucking amino acid supplement that he takes. That I've seen, maybe not, but uh, that I've seen it is. Seven grams of BCAs, and then another three grams of a cent. Okay, calling his kid a loser for the yo-yo thing was over the top, whatever, but Jesus. That just annoyed me. So 10, gram, 10 grams total of essentials. Then the intracarb is um, mostly designer carbohydrates, cluster dextrin, and platinose here. Um, both of these mix really well. They absorb right into your bloodstream when you drink them. And then um, the last thing here is a pre-workout. This is our new pre-workout. Oh it's my called God. GX. We just launched this two weeks ago. Um, it's loaded with nootropics. It's not a pre heavy stem pre-workout. It's a heavy nootropic, nootropic and pump pre-workout. So it has six grams of citrulline, two grams of betaine nitrate to get your blood vessels dilated. And then nootropic wise, it's got 100 milligrams of active teocrine. It's got 300 milligrams of alpha GPC. It has 500 milligrams of lion's mane extract, which is a clinical dose. It's two grams crude, but with the four to one extract we use, we purify down on the 500 milligrams. Those are typically the days I take it on. Um, we have the sour power flavor, by the way, which is extremely sour. That's a, I take um, the sports performance uh, products. I take the general health performance products. I found his son, Zik. This is going to be like the Eddie Hall video all over again. Oh, uh, wait. I'll log into Streamlabs here so we can do it. Here we go. Well, your son's a piece of fucking shit just like you, asshole. Uh, yeah, there he is, fucking torturing animals. Yeah, putting a hook through a fish's mouth. Yeah, hopefully he dies of heart attack soon, too. Yeah, I'm sure he got COVID from you. And uh, I'm sure he eats like shit, just like his dad. So yeah, hopefully that piece of crap also fucking dies in his sleep. Let's see. 
I, I love how this fucking kid is acting as if he loved- Oh, look at the dog! Look at the dog! Oh, yeah, fucking put a hook through a fish's mouth. So his hobbies include yo-yos, torturing animals, and yeah, that's about it. All right. Fucking asshole. Products I take and the heart health stuff I'm doing. I feel really, really good about the heart health <laughs> stuff I'm taking. And i um, <laughs> very, very happy with how my heart's recovering. The, the proof will be in the pudding next month, though. Next month. <laughs> <laughs> oh! The proof will be in the pudding next month. He died. <laughs> he died the next month. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. Month I get, I get an echocardiogram oh my God. done, which is a very specific way of looking at um, oh, this is heart too function. Good. So I'll be able to see how my heart's functioning uh, probably in about four weeks. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, if I get a green oh light on that, um, then I'm basically good to go. Because when I looked at my heart, it was normal size and I had no plaque. I Very little. I did have a tiny bit, which oh, is normal for a guy shit. my age. I'll just skip over this. You can look at Greg's video if you want. Just because Richard knows that commenting on John's child was over the top doesn't mean that he... People were complaining that I was making, um, what is it, very petty kind of insults. And I said, yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay, big deal. Can stop doing it. I don't think he can stop. He is so perpetually angry. He can't stop. And again, maybe he has that lack of empathy that would, uh, you know, keep most people from... So, a natural vegan, if you look at the stream I did, uh, when was I angry? The only time I was angry was when I was looking at his kid torturing and killing animals. But the rest of the stream, I was just laughing and happy. I was, I was enjoying myself. Why do you think I'm angry constantly? The only time I get angry or upset is when I watch people like you. From doing something like that because we don't want to hurt people's feelings. He doesn't have that. He doesn't care. Like, again, I, I keep repeating myself over and over again, but, like, this is the fundamental problem. Yeah, why would I care if I hurt somebody's feelings? That's not a rights violation. And, and especially, like, again, we're talking about a stream that happened at 3 in the morning that barely anyone was watching, and I deleted after. Like, this is what you're making a big deal about, but then you're fine with openly advocating for a fucking holocaust. I don't measure anything. <laughs> Well, someone is a uh, dumb, dumb. I will give you 100 non-spam dollars if this stream ends up on Keemstar. Um. Probably not going to end up on Keemstar. Probably going to take this down just to be safe with uh, TOS, but thanks for the donation, spam boy. Appreciate it. I did go pretty hard, so yeah, probably want to play things safe. Anyway, yeah, um, not impressed with Mountain Dog. Um, yeah, uh, I stand by what I said, uh, if not more so. Don't think he was a good person. I glad the guy's dead. Uh, he was knowingly and willingly harming animals when he knew it was wrong. So good. One less animal abuser left alive. Ugh. Oh, my ass, dude. Jesus. Joint care. <clears throat> this I take mostly for my joints. Oh, my God. I agree okay. with you on your opinions. But are you worried about the incoming shitstorm from this stream of Lamau? Fucking I hilarious, do not... though, bro. Meow. Yeah, I don't give a shit. People can come after me if they want. This is just fucking hilarious. I'll rub it in. Oh, I will rub it, rub it in. But uh, thanks for the nation spam, boy. Appreciate it. Yeah, uh, I take B12, vitamin D. Oh, yeah, if you're vegan, you have to take so many supplements. <laughs> Gotta be so careful. Get enough nutrients as a vegan. I think, I think like, fucking 27 supplements. But if I was vegan, I'd have to take 70 supplements. It has UC2 in it, which is my favorite supplement for joints. It's got a clinical...
Wait, it's okay. So yeah, the joint care collagen. Okay. Double dose, forty milligrams, plus another five hundred milligrams of curcumin, which went with the five hundred milligrams and that's in the Morpho Prime. So it gives me about a gram, which is plenty of real high quality <laughs> curcumin. So those are kind of the health supplements. And then from a performance standpoint, well, one more. Actually, this is kind of more of a food. So my protein powder, I take. This is from. Oh, he can't get enough protein. Weird. He eats meat, but he has to take a supplement. Okay, we'll add that too. Uh, protein supplement. The well, vegans can't get enough protein. They have to take supplements. Vegans have to take supplements to get enough protein, guys. Uh, weird. Uh, funny. All that meat, you still have to take a supplement, dude. For my company, Granite. Um, it's a blend. It's a blend of whey casein and beef and egg protein. Most of the protein in here is whey and casein. Holy shit. And oh my god. I put digestive enzymes in it. Yeah, it's it's not it's not bad enough that you're uh, getting fucking whey protein from tortured, murdered fucking cows. But let's add chicken, uh, so fucking eggs, tortured, murdered chickens, and uh, fucking cows too. Like, uh, uh, guess cows from other sources. We, yeah, two different sources of tortured, murdered cows. What a fucking That's asshole. Fingers. Hello everyone, your lord and master, Vegan Gains, has arrived. Uh, so, a lot of people have been asking what's been going on. I did a live stream the other day, but I figured I'd just make a video about this, just to update you all on what's been going on with the channel. So, I received two community guideline strikes. Uh, everybody thinks it's because of John Meadows and I got my channel terminated. That's not what happened. Uh, the strikes had nothing to do with John Meadows, actually. It's just YouTube. Um, not applying their community guidelines um, consistently. For some reason, they're just very harshly uh, judging what I upload. So um, I had to private all my videos. So right now they're all privated. That's why I didn't delete anything. They're all privated. That's why you can't see any old videos right now. Uh, what I'm going to do is just gradually uh, make them public again. I just want to comb through all my old footage make sure that it doesn't violate terms of service in any way. So I've already deleted quite a few videos, you know, some worst of the fitness industry videos, stuff like that. Unfortunately, um, that's just the situation I'm in right now. YouTube is just really harshly, you know, kind of coming down on my channel. So, uh, you know, I got to do what I got to do. If you want to see all my uh, old content right now, you can check out LBRY, which is an app. I'm on that app. Uh, or you can go to Odyssey, which is the web browser version. So if you want to see all my old videos right now or any content that I've deleted, you can just go over there. Um, but, you know, again, uh, videos are going to slowly get, uh, you know, become public again over the next few weeks, just as I go through all this footage. Um, and if I ever receive a strike on my channel again and, you know, if I or my channel gets terminated, uh, check out my wife's channel, Jasmine Gaines. Uh, she can, you know, update everybody. Uh, she streams on that channel, too. So uh, if that ever happens again, just check out Jasmine Gaines and then uh, you can be updated on the situation because I'm not on Twitter anymore. Uh,